Hey man, I'm new to the game. You mind if I sit here and learn? Maybe try a hand with you? You say you're new to the game? Have a seat and play for some money. Sweet man, thanks. Deal them up. All right, here's your cards. Go first. Sweet man, thanks. Ooh, this is a good hand too. Let's see what we got. I think I'm gonna, I'm just gonna win right now, all in. Here's my cards. Read them and weep. This is the first hand you've ever played and you're gonna cheat me like that? We're gonna deal with this. Man, how am I cheating? I had a four, a seven, an eight, a nine, an I, and a joker. How is that cheating? Of course you're cheating. You got an I and a joker. That's not even cards to play in this game. I don't like cheaters. We deal with them. Let me show you how. Ugh. Good thing I brought my lucky deck of cards. Ugh. Welcome back to Slightly Less Tactical. Today we're gonna try shooting some playing cards. It's finally a nice day with no win. So I bought us 16 decks of playing cards here. You guys are set up nice and close. I mounted them down to this board. So in the way we always do, we're gonna start with the 22 and work our way up. We got our selection set up here. I finally got a table out here. Make things go a little bit faster. So let me get the loaded, uh, let me load up the 22 and we'll start this. I finally got our 22 up and working. She's working great. I'm using a 38 grain CCI 22, uh, just straight lead. Let's see how we go here. Wow, way too close for that kind of power. There we go. Oh, I should be able to see good. Good solid hit. I didn't hit record on you guys, now I think about it. Let's go take a look. I'm gonna bet two. Definitely went through the first one. Stopped right there. Yeah, I hit the second one, but it didn't go through. Let's take a look here. You can see the bullet right there. Let me see if I can pull it out. There it is. Wow, that's hot. Nothing left, there's a little hole. There's our exit wound. Looks like it just came through though. Just enough to hit this one, but not break anything. So we'll take this one out for now. Set this aside and I'll push these back together and we'll hit it with the uh, nine mil. All right guys, I had to take the cowboy hat off. Can't put my ear pro on with it. Guess it gives me a chance to show off this uh, motivated haircut I got. So we got the nine mil ready. We're shooting 124 grain hollow points out of a Glock 19X. Ear pro down. There we go. Here we go. Cards everywhere. I'm gonna say it went through four and stopped in the fifth one. Let's go take a look. Even though it shot cards everywhere, broke that deck completely in half. There's one, two. That one is broke, but it didn't go through. There's two. Is there any more around here? I'm seeing two. The bullet must uh, do this one. Definitely went through the first one, it looks like here. Into the second. I don't see any more damage. Except for this one's just cracked, but it's not gone through. So I was way wrong through two decks and then went off somewhere. Next up, we'll try a 40 cal, see if we get different results. Couldn't find the nine millimeter. Went through two decks of cards and stopped. So we're gonna move up to a 40 cal using 180 grain full metal jackets out of a Smith & Wesson M&P. All right, here we go. Go 
check it out. Put a block of wood on top of it to try to keep it from shooting cards everywhere. That funny smell. Looks like I might have hit a little low. Definitely hit a little low. Let's see how far it went though. Let's see if it dug through the table right there. And I can't see it. Let me load up and we'll do that one again. All right, here's our second shot at the 40 cal. Same thing, 180 grain out of a Smith & Wesson M&P. That looked like a better hit. Cars went everywhere. Let's go take a look. Of course, I forgot to record on you guys. Looks like it hit the side. One, two. Push the second one. Came out the side of the third the third one here. All right. Well, let's try. I'm gonna use some of these other decks for this one. We're gonna use the 44 mag. I got the 44 mag here, 240 grain solid lead. Oh, I always screw that up. There we go. All right, here we go. I don't know. Maybe I missed. Let me go take a look. Didn't see anything happen. I was aiming right here. All right, I think I brought another one. So let me load it up and we'll see. Got another 44 mag. Still 240 grain. This one's a, a hollow point though. Let's see if we can hit this one. Definitely hit that one. It's clear. Let's go take a look. I don't know how it missed that one. Definitely hit that one. That one. These ones did not get hit. Let's take a look down here. Looks like we might have shot to the left. Some of them got hit really hard though. So for 44 mag, uh, unknown how many cards it stops. Let's uh, get the next gun going. Now we're done with the 44 mag, we're gonna step it up to a 223, 55 grain full metal jackets. All right, here we go. Solid hit. I don't think I missed on that one. Let's turn this EOTech off because Tend to forget. All right, let's go take a look. Put some fresh cards in the front. Right there. Two. Growing. Three. Four. Five. Six, maybe? And stopped in the seventh. Seven decks of cards to stop at 223. See if we could dig it out of here. It's just powder by now. That's all it is, just powder. Oh, there is some. If I can get that out of there. There we go. That's all that's left of that 223. Oh, no, there's some more in there. There's the back of it. Looks like it just shattered right there on the, what was it, seventh deck of cards. All right, let's move up to the 762. As always, shooting Wolf 123 grain full metal jackets out of this AK-47 with a dead sight. Let's see if we can hit it at, you know, six feet. All right. I don't know how to aim. I think I missed. Shoot again. Missed again, here we go. There we go. There we go. Cards everywhere. Definitely didn't like getting hit by that. Let's go take a look. That card, that bullet opened up all those decks down there. Looks like the first one will hit high. Two, three, four. Let's 
five, six, seven, going through sideways it looks like. Looks like about seven still. Those ones are already broken, I just had them in the back. So not much difference between the AK and the 762. Next up, we'll do the 12 gauge. Well, that's gonna just destroy everything, but it'll be fun. All right, shotgun's ready. I stacked up all the cards, even if they're broken, because we know this is just gonna make a giant mess for me to clean up. Using two and three quarter inch uh, Fioco, uh, Fioki double lot out of a Mossberg 930 JM Pro. Tactical class. Might be a little too tactical for slightly less tactical. Here we go. Cards everywhere. Let's go take a look. Well, definitely uh, pushed them all off the end of the table. There's some buckshot. Wow, that's hot. Right there with the others. Not expecting it to go through everything, but I know that force is just gonna push it so hard. <clears throat> well, I have no idea what order those are in. So apparently 12 gauge, you know, devil out buckshot is not really liked by playing cards. Let me clean this all up and I'll get back with you. All right, we got the range all cleaned up. Apparently, you know, cards aren't probably the best body armor to use, but if you have more than say eight decks, you can pretty much stop any common round. Got a couple decks left over. If you guys want them, let me know in the comments. I'll sign them and send them to you. For, you know, someday when I'm broken famous, you guys will have something to remember the early days from me. Thanks for watching Slightly Less Tactical. We'll see you next time.